Hi everybody, ever lost uh, an end defender off your pole? Well here's an easy quick fix you can do immediately. All you need is uh, some old window cleaning squeegee rubbers, all right? like that, slap it on the end of your pole and tape it up with um, insulation tape. I'll just show you how I did it. It's the simplest way of doing it here. See if I can uh, line the camera up properly. Okay, the first thing to do is get some uh, used squeegee rubber. This might not work, by the way, on a, on a larger pole, but uh, these poles, I just made them up myself. Um, these have got an ergonomic tip on the end here uh, for shops. And you can see this one hasn't got one on it, it's sharp as a razor. And if you hit anything with that, especially a car, you're going to make a serious scratch in it. Okay, so uh, what I actually did some window cleaning rubber. Right, cut the end square first. Doesn't have to be absolutely perfect. Wrap it around the end. All you need for this job is uh, some insulation tape, a pair of scissors, and a pencil. Or a pen, it doesn't matter. Mark off the circumference of the pole. Cut it again so it fits. And you see the, the rubber there has got the rounded bit there. That's what you want at the bottom of the pole. You put that at the bottom, slightly proud of the end. Bring it round there like that. And you can see fits. Piece of cake. Okay. Now get your insulation tape. Here's one I cut earlier. And I've backed it with insulation tape already. There isn't much on there, but there's a reason for that. You get the end of your pole. Right, you can start it off. It's easier to do it like this. Don't forget, you need it proud of the actual pole. Like that. You see? Okay. Wind it round. And then you can see the uh, other end meets quite nicely there. If there's a bit of a gap it doesn't really matter as long as it's not too big you see. And now that's on there. Next step just get your insulation tape and tape it on good and proper like so. But then go up onto the pole a little bit so it doesn't actually come off. You can see that there, as clear as anything. Just cut it off. And there you have it, job done. Whether this will work on larger poles, I don't know. You'd have to try it. But it works a treat for smaller poles like this. Absolutely superb. Well, there you go, I'm happy with that. That's two poles done. And that's job done.